Bella O'Grady uh, and from the 400 meter and the 4x4. I um, did little athletics at Northern Suburbs from under eights and that definitely ignited my fire to um, continue athletics. I absolutely loved it. So I've been running my whole life and um, all of the support that sort of began there um, definitely instilled in me my, my passion and desire to keep on running. Do you know what? I feel like a lot of people will say this. I would be stuck with Katrina Pissett, mostly because A, she's a great company. B, she's studying architecture, so I feel like maybe she could develop and build a way to get out of there. Um, and just, yeah, she'd have really good banter and kind of wouldn't, you know, dance around anything. She'd just like, get us off. Most definitely my coach, Penny Gillies. Um, it's my first senior team and I'm so humbled to be on it and most definitely is because of her that I'm here. We had a pretty rough and rocky start to the season so I'm so elated to be here and I, I couldn't have done it without her dedication, time and, and putting up with me more or less. So um, thank you, Penny. I love to get cookies and ice cream from Coles, and then you melt the cookies, and then you put it with the ice cream, and it's a winning combination. You will have been inundated with the response of Kathy Freeman, but I'm gonna say Kathy Freeman because I think she also ran and won Olympic gold at a really interesting time, being, you know, 2000, when obviously there was still a lot happening, um, and there was a large disparity between Axie people and, and Anglo, Saxon or Anglo-Australian, so, um, you know, I think she put herself at the forefront of, um, you know, the sport and, and won Olympic gold and really brought attention, um, which is super crucial uh, in this day and age, so definitely happy for